Grizzlies, grannies and grandpas. Think back to the Grizzlies in 2005, back when Lorenzen Wright and Shane Battier were on the court, another team was swarming. Nearly two decades later, and you can still see the Grizzlies, grannies and grandpas from the stands during a Grizz game at halftime. So exciting. So excited. We just love it. At 71 years old, Opal has been on the team the longest. They are 16 seasons in, but she says the idea started back in 05. That first year, we didn't have to try out or anything. Now, more than 200 audition every season, hoping for the chance to dance on the court with the senior squad. They had preparation classes, and I went to all of them, and they just about killed me. But I practiced at home. I even videoed myself and watched myself so I could see how I was doing. Today, 71-year-old Scott practices for game day with the team. He says what happens in these hallways and on the court is life-changing for those who have seen the Grizzlies rise over the decades. Earlier this season, we had one dancer pass away and we gathered together and uh, took up a collection to try to support them. And we also had a couple of other tragedies that we've just really bound together. And it's, I can't imagine not being around all these people. Bonding through hours dedicated to practicing behind the scenes, then walking into the forum to practice on the court, hours before every home game. Making sure they get every step right. Starting in the middle, so y'all are here. Proving that grit and grind doesn't have an age limit. And the oldest lady that's on the team now, she's 79 years old. Yes, she'll be 80 this year. So it's never too late to do um, what you dream of, what you would like to do. Um, the doors are open. Okay, now come off. We can practice in the back. In downtown Memphis, Shay Simon, WREG News Channel 3. Oh, AJ, nothing but a number. They are proving.